What's up? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Uh, why am I here on the floor? Um, I have a task project assignment uh, to show you for robotics with the Lego EV3 Mindstorms robot. So let's get to it. Ready, set, go. Okay, so here is the project task or assignment, whatever you want to call it. Uh, I had some wonderful uh, robotics students build this robot for me here. It's basically a simple robot, uh, two motors for the wheels, and then a motor right here, this medium motor here, to grab, and I'll show you in a second what's gonna happen in this project. So my students are studying bomb disposal robots. So I thought, well, what, hey, what better project for them to actually see what the bomb disposal drivers uh, you know, feel like, what do they go through, uh, to control the robot to actually take out a bomb. So I thought I would set up a little real life action for here, for them to do. So here is, right there, the bomb that they will need to dispose of. So their robot is gonna need that medium motor to basically grab uh, this tubing here for the bomb. And to safely dispose it, they're going to have to put it into that gray, green container over there to basically safely dispose of it. So their task is gonna to be to use their um, commander apps on their phone to control the robot, to pick up the bomb, and then dispose of it over there in the green container. So what I'm actually gonna do is show you also how do you get um, the control for this medium motor up on your commander app. So let's go straight to it. Okay, everybody, I brought up my commander app here on my phone. Um, so obviously I have to film here with my GoPro, so hang with me here on this one. So we're going to go over here and go to the, oops, let me go back. All right, so we're going to go to the create and command your own robot. We'll go ahead and select that. All right, so the first thing we do, like always, is we'll just hit one of these plus buttons. And I don't have a problem with the joystick. Uh, you just have to be, again, mindful of the letters for your motors. So when you're ready, just hit the plus button down here. And now we wanna get set up for that medium motor that's gonna lift the bomb. So just hit another plus sign somewhere. And then I don't necessarily want another joystick. I mean, you could. But um, I'm going to go over here and go to the horizontal slider. You could also use a vertical slider if you want to. It doesn't really matter. They're going to all control that motor the same way. But I'm going to go to the horizontal slider. Um, just be mindful again that you click the right numbered port. So just check and see. You can always change it on your robot. But I think it defaults to A here. So that's cool. Uh, that's what I have my motor in. And then I'm going to hit the plus button down here. Okay, so there we go. There's going to be my controls for this bomb disposal robot. The joystick to, whoops, got out of that one. So the joystick to control the robot right there, and the horizontal slider to move that medium motor. Okay, so let's go ahead and watch it in action. Okay, so to review the assignment here, I'm going to have my robot over here where the start is, drive over here to the yellow bomb briefcase and then end up disposing of, disposing of it here in this green container. All right, so let's go to it. Okay, so I've, I've hooked into my Bluetooth here, so I'm gonna be driving away, trying to pick up this bomb and disposing of it. Here we go. Those of you that have used the Commander app know that it's not the easiest thing in the world. You have to uh, really be slow with your movements. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you that medium motor with the slider. So there's how I control that. Let me make sure it's in the right position. Got a Move this really slow or else, you know, it gets really out of control, just like almost that did. Okay. Want to 
line this up right. Let's see if I can get a good con uh, contact here. This arm needs to go a little bit. Whoa. Ooh, not bad. Okay, so I got it picked up. I'll have to lift it a little higher. Okay, and now I'm going to start to head over to that green uh, container. Let me go ahead and move the camera so you can see that. Okay, so I'm going to start heading over to that green container. Here we go. And there you go. We disposed of the bomb properly. And that's just another cool task that you can use with this Lego EV3 robot. So I'm gonna go ahead now and show you another task that uh, my students did with uh, pushing uh, a bomb to a safe place. So hopefully that was cool with the Lego Commander app. Okay, so here's the other task. Uh, it's another bomb disposal task. Uh, it uses uh, something in the front of your robot to push. Uh, my students are going to pretend this is another bomb. And instead of lifting it with that medium motor, they're going to be pushing it to a safe place with this attachment here that they will trap the bomb with and then push it to a safe location. So let's check that out and see how that works. Okay, so here's the other task. We start in that same starting position. We're going to drive over here to this bomb. And then we're going to push it right here into this safe area right there. So let's go ahead and check out how that's going to work. Okay, I want you to definitely get the uh, bird's eye view on this. So I'm going to hold my camera up here while I'm controlling uh, the robot with my phone. Hopefully this works okay. So. Bear with me, I'm using one hand on this. So my students will have to trap this bomb in their attachment like so. And then basically drag it like I'm doing right here into that safe area. And they've safely disposed of that bomb correctly. So I thought this was just a neat uh, project for my students to do to build this bomb disposal robot with the motors to uh, lift and drop the other bomb into this green container to be able to put an attachment on the front to push a bomb. And so we had a great uh, project studying uh, bomb disposal robots and it was really neat to finish it off with actually putting them in the driver's seat to do that. So thank you for watching uh, hopefully that was uh, cool neat something you might be able to do those of you that teach robotics and uh, thank you again and I am out bye